What's up, Flavor Squad? It's your girl, Fashionisha, here to give you all the flavor. If you are new here, make sure you hit that like button, make sure you subscribe, and make sure you comment down below, hashtag Flavor Squad. If you are not new here, I thank you so much for coming back to my channel. It is January 1st, 2023, so Happy New Year to all of you guys out there, especially my subscribers. If you're subscribed to me, Happy New Year to you, and I hope your new year is filled with joy, peace, growth, change, progression, all of it. I just hope you have a great, great 2023. Um, so my camera's about to die, but I wanted to intro this video. So last year, as I was doing my reflection on how 2022 went for me, I was just looking back and I was not, don't get me wrong, I had growth for sure. Like I really, really grew, my company grew, everything, but I wasn't focused at the beginning of the year on dynamic. I was focused on fashionisha and dynamic but towards the end of the year mid-year i put fashionisha on the back burn started focusing on dynamic and that's when i really started to see some growth um so i just want to make sure in 2023 that i just keep my foot on the gas with dynamic and i feel like if i do that if i start right at the beginning of the year stay consistent throughout the year i'll see so much more growth so that's what i'm gonna do this year that's my focus um don't ask me to make nothing custom. Don't ask me to do any clothing hauls. Don't ask me to do any um, DIYs. I'm sorry, it's not gonna happen because that's not my focus right now. And I'm just trying to, I'm just trying to get there. I'm trying to get to the bag. I'm trying to get to the goal. Okay. And the only way for me to do that is for me to stay focused on my brand. So yeah, today is the first day of 2023, and I definitely wanted to just start this year off right so today i'm going downtown savannah downtown savannah to river street and i'm gonna set up and we're gonna bring t-shirts out there um a few hoodies out there and maybe a few sweatshirts to sell i'm doing this scared like i'm super excited to do this but one thing i'm trying to do is to just do what i say i'm gonna do because last year I would say like, oh, I'm going to do this. This is such a great idea. And it would be a great idea, but it would be so scary for me to actually do it. And I just don't do it. So this year, I just really want to do it. Even if I am scared to do it, even if I am nervous, just do it. Because I never know what could come out of it. Um, so that's what I'm doing today. I'm doing it scared. Um, this is not my thing. <laughs> Like, I don't even know if I'm allowed to do this downtown. I see a lot of people set up downtown, so I just feel like, I mean, they're not getting arrested or anything, so why should I worry? <laughs> so, yeah, I'm doing that today. Wish me luck. I'm bringing you guys along the journey. Um, I'm about to make up a few more shirts today so that I can have a good amount of inventory to take out there. Uh, yeah, so if I don't show you guys too much of me preparing the shirts and things like that, it's because my camera is about to die. In 2023, I need to get more camera batteries. Put that on the list. So, let's get ready to do it scared. Hopefully, I can inspire somebody else to do it scared, no matter what. So, I will see you guys, I don't know, when my camera charges up, okay? Happy New Year once again. Let's get into this video. All right, y'all. We got a box full of wristbands, keychains, t-shirts that I'm taking out there. That box has. full of wristbands. For well, a person who doesn't want to be on camera, you talk about. Look, <laughs> <laughs> well, I have to make my presence known. Mm. Shoes, keep it real from the junk, cause you get a little pump, little vibe, little bass, little kick, little snare, little lies, big truth, do you 
you, they don't care. Do you, they don't care. Get your ass out the box and build up on them. I don't have a gang with me, but I still walk with a gangster lean. I rock Nikes cause we think they're clean. MJ never jacket be Billy Jean. MJ never jacket cause I think I'm bad. I like it. Okay, y'all, we made it out here. Table is all set up. Let me show you. Move your high knee. I almost forgot about y'all, but we still out here handing out our free wristbands. Got some sales. Got a couple sales. It's going good so far. Still out here doing it scared. I am so nervous. I don't know why she's nervous. She got me with her. She shouldn't be nervous. But still, I gotta talk to people and it's just like, <laughs> hey, you. <laughs> But yes, we still out here. Uh, I might come back to you guys when we're done to just let you know how it went all the way. So I'll be back. Y'all, we have finally made it home. I'm in my robe. I did want to come in and just give you guys a review on how I think that went. Honestly, it was pretty good and I would definitely do it again. I actually told Gerard that I want to do it at least maybe once every other weekend because that's usually when i'm off like every other weekend so at least get out there one day i do want to just continue to do pop-up shops any type of events that i can do just so i can get dynamic out there you know it's always important just to get the product out um as you guys saw we did give out wristbands but on those wristbands we attached this card with a qr code on it so that you can at least go look at the website if you would like um because i didn't have everything out there so if it was something i didn't have you could definitely purchase it online it was pretty good um it was pretty good i think college prepared me for like the nose because we used to sit up in like the uc at college and you get nose all the time like people just didn't feel like dealing with whatever you had going on when you were set up in the UC so it was like that too like people people said no they didn't want a free wristband which was crazy to me I mean it's a free wristband <laughs> but whatever you just have to push through and keep going in my opinion people are really responsive today and I do feel like if we set up in a different area downtown it could be good too the area we were set up in wasn't the best in my opinion because it was a lot of people down there but it wasn't as much as like a different area um so next time we're definitely going to try to get out there early and get set up in another area but overall it was very good i definitely suggest you do it scared <laughs> um i was very nervous just because this is just not my thing like <laughs> talking to people it's just talking to people when they don't know what i'm talking about like like if I'm at work and I'm talking to you about something at my job, it's easy because you came in here for what I have to offer you. But I'm coming in your space trying to offer you something. So it's just kind of like, mm, I got this for you. <laughs> it's a little hard, but I'm definitely gonna grow out of that. Um, I definitely appreciate Gerard being out there with me because he's more open. He's the outgoing one. When it comes to me and him, He's the outgoing one. So it was very helpful to see how he did it. And then I just do the same thing and it actually works. So yeah, it was very helpful. I really, I enjoyed it. I, I Although I was nervous, although I was, when I say I had anxiety, y'all, I had anxiety. But I do feel like it was worth it. If you have a clothing brand, if you have a business, it's just some things you have to get over. You have to bring yourself out of your comfort zone. If you don't bring yourself out of your comfort zone, there's no way you're going to grow. There's no way your business is going to grow. So that's where my head was at. Like in 2022, I just did a lot of, I did a lot of, I was walking in fear a lot because like I said, that's just something I don't do. But this year I definitely want to just step out more and do, do more become more comfortable with the uncomfortable if that makes sense so yeah don't be afraid to do that it's not as bad as it seems it's not as bad as we make it in our heads 
because a lot of people, a lot of strangers want you to succeed. They want to see you win, although they don't even know you, but they do want to see you win. So just keep that in your mind. Keep positive statements, positive affirmations in your mind and do it. It's okay. In order to change the dynamic, in order to change your life, you have to change. So this is me making my changes. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's all I have for you guys. I definitely hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe. Make sure you check out Dynamic on all of our social medias at Dynamic X Fashion. And also visit the website at DynamicXFashion.com. But that's all I have for you guys. Continue to be dynamic and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.